Salam, kids. Welcome to your channel, Islam Station. The topic we are going to be discussing today is the Battle of Badar. The Battle of Badr was a very important event in Islamic history. It happened a long time ago, after Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him, and the Muslims moved to a city called Medina. It was a treaty that united Muslims, Jews, and other communities in Medina to live peacefully and defend each other. After Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, and the Muslims migrated to Medina, the Quraysh of Mecca felt threatened. They had been hostile to the Muslims for many years, and they didn't want Islam to grow. The Muslims didn't plan for a battle. They were going after a Quraysh caravan that had taken their property. When they heard about the Quraysh army coming, Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, gathered around 313 companions to defend Medina, even though they were outnumbered. Show kids how small the Muslim army was compared to the Quraysh's 1,000 soldiers, Soldiers, yet they were strong in faith. Allah helped the Muslims in miraculous ways. Angels were sent by Allah to assist them in battle. Allah has said in Surah Al-Anfal, verse 8, 9, Remember when you implored the help of your Lord, and he answered you, I will reinforce you with a thousand angels, one after another. The moment when Allah sent rain to help the Muslims occurred during the Battle of Badr, a significant event in Islamic history. The rain made the soft, shifting sand firm underfoot, which gave the Muslim army better mobility and steadiness as they prepared for battle. Meanwhile, in the Quraysh camp, the rain turned their ground muddy, making it difficult for them to move around. Allah has said in Surah Al-Anfal, verse 8, 11, Remember when he covered you with a slumber as a security from him, and he sent down upon you rain from the sky to cleanse you thereby, and remove from you the evil of Satan, and to make steadfast your hearts, and plant firmly thereby your feet. The Muslims won the battle, and it was a great victory for Islam. The Muslim strength grew, and the Quraysh began to realize the power of this new Muslim community. Despite being fewer in number, the Muslims showed great courage and trust in Allah. O oh Allah, if this small group of Muslims is destroyed, you will not be worshipped on earth. Allah answered the Prophet's prayer by sending down his divine support. The next day, the Muslims, despite being outnumbered, won a miraculous victory. Allah sent angels to assist the Muslims during the battle. On the night before the battle, while the Muslim army rested, Prophet Muhammad spent the entire night in dua and prayer, asking Allah for help and victory. He raised his hands high in supplication pleading with Allah for the safety and success of the Muslims. No matter how hard the situation is, when we have faith in Allah, He will help us. The Muslims worked together, and this unity was key to their success. Even though the Muslims won, Prophet Muhammad treated the captives from the Quraysh fairly, teaching us the importance of mercy. The Battle of Badr was not just a victory on the battlefield, but a powerful lesson for all of us. Allah has said in Surah Al-Imran, verse 3, 123, And Allah has already given you victory at Badr while you were few in number. So fear Allah that you may be grateful. So kids, that's all for today. Allah Hafiz.